Welcome to the Nikol Metallurgical Complex in the south of New Caledonia. This state-of-the-art facility was first built in 2004 in this prime location, which consists of a 190 hectares of mine atop the hills and a metallurgical plant with a port. The mine hall road stretches for 4 kilometers and allows mine trucks to bring the ore to the preparation unit. Once the product is milled, the ore slurry is pumped through a 7 kilometer long pipeline that crosses the mine site to arrive at the refinery further down the hill. The slurry is then sent to the high pressure acid leach circuit. There are three of them. In this circuit, the slurry is heated up and pressurized in a unique vessel called the fleeter. This two-in-one system was designed to recover the steam produced by the flashing of the leached slurry exiting the autoclave. Once the product is leached by sulfuric acid, the slurry is then washed through six counter current decanters. These are 70 meters in diameter and can hold up about 16,000 cubic meters. The pregnant liquor solution can be stored in a big pond or can be sent to the partial neutralization circuit. Once the solution has been neutralized with limestone and lime, it is sent to the NHC precipitation circuit. Magnesium oxide is added to recover nickel and cobalt as mixed hydroxides. The NHC product is then filtered, packaged in big bag and then transported all the way up to the port. One of the biggest advantages of the South Industrial Complex is its own port, capable of docking two carriers and a ferry for the crew. It opens out directly to the outside market and simplifies the import for raw materials such as coal, sulfur and limestone. The port and the plant are linked with a 3.5 km conveyor to carry the raw materials straight back on site. The coal is transported to supply the power plant on site with a production capacity of 100 MW. The sulfur is conveyed to the acid plant, which can produce around 4,360 tons meters per day with a storage capacity of 60,000 tons. The South Industrial Complex is a truly unique location. It is completely autonomous and has all the necessities on site to get the job done. It also sits in the most spectacular settings in New Caledonia, the South, the richest environment this country can offer.